Bless you. Amen. Pastor Benny here at Love Wings Ministry Studios. Amen. In spirit and in truth. Oh, yes, Father, we thank you tonight, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Amen. As I come on, Lord, to share your truth, Lord. Knowing that no weapon formed against us will ever prosper, Lord. Hallelujah. God is good. And what better way to just start a program than to just come with thanksgiving in our hearts. Amen. As I come tonight to encourage you, and I'm here with my mini-me. Amen. Standing in for me. Amen. I'm going to put him on the side now. Amen. God is good. God bless you. Hey. Father, I thank you for this opportunity that I could come on tonight to encourage my brothers and sisters out there here from Love Wings Ministry Studios. Te doy gracias, Señor, esta noche que puedo venir primero a alabar su nombre. Hallelujah. En nombre de Jesús. Y tener un tiempo con mis hermanos y mis hermanas. Amen. Dejándoles saber Su palabra, Señor, y cuanto tú lo quieres a ellos. I come again tonight in spirit and in truth to share the love of God. Amen. Oh, hallelujah. Well, Father, I thank you again for this opportunity that I could come here tonight, Lord, to encourage my brothers and sisters. And even now that we're in the season of Thanksgiving, which should be every day, Lord, but I thank you, Lord, that around the world it is recognized to give thanks to you, Father, who art in heaven. And let your will be done in heaven here on earth. Oh, hallelujah. So use us tonight, use me tonight to encourage my brothers and sisters with your word that continues to set us free and break the chains that have been holding us back for so long but we I come in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth to share the truth nothing but the truth and in spirit and in truth amen amen I want to give a shout out to all those that I know number one and all those that I don't know amen and I'm just here doing what God called me to do and he's called all of us to come and to give thanks and to share the good news. Amen. I see Natasha's on there. Amen. Watching. Amen. My lovely wife. Amen. And she knows we're here. And every time you hear this, that's man God is letting you know that he's watching over you and he's watching over me. So again, I thank the Lord for this opportunity. And I come to you today to share some word with you and the first one I want to start off with amen is this Colossians chapter 3 15 says but let the peace of Christ amen rule in your heart since as a member of one body we are called oh you were you were called to peace and be what thankful Amen. Being thankful. And I know that we celebrate the season now of Thanksgiving. And as we're coming into Thanksgiving, that's why I'm here tonight, as always, Tuesday nights. Amen. And and just sharing the gospel, the truth, the love of God, and how much he loves you and he cares for you. Amen. And remember that 
Devote yourself to prayer and being watchful and thankful. And that's something that we celebrate in this time where we come with our friends and our families and we sit down and like the pilgrims did back in Columbus Day, <laughs> you know, when Columbus discovered, amen, if I remember my history, amen. <laughs> But he come and we break uh, turkey and rice and gondolas and all that other good stuff that we eat. Amen. And your family's out there. And it's a beautiful time because we gather. And the essence of that day is to give thanks for what God has already done in your life. And giving thanks for your family and your friends. And it's a time, my brothers and sisters, that we are to forgive those in our lives that whatever has happened it doesn't really matter amen i'm always sharing with everybody we get one chance at this so let us do it with thanksgiving in our hearts and with gratitude and grateful because god loves for us to love one another and to care for one another amen mi hermanos y mi hermanas que están allá afuera es un tiempo que le damos gracias lo que el Señor nos da cuando lo sientamos en Thanksgiving. Pero recuérdate que todos los días, amén, le damos gracias al Señor. Pero este día todo el mundo celebra ese día de vamos a sentarnos a comer. Eh, y, eh, y, pero lo más importante, lo que estaba diciendo en inglés, vamos a uh, eso que lo that hurt us, no sé cómo digo en español, que te hizo algo, vamos a darle forgiveness, recuérdate que el Señor lo perdonó a los otros, esa es la palabra que estaba buscando yo, vamos a perdonar a esos que, este, eh, eh, de hoy para adelante, todo el mundo, y vamos a enseñar el amor del Señor, con todos los mis hermanos y mis hermanas. Amen. So I say that to say this, man, that remember Colossians 3.15, it says, Let the peace of Christ rule in your heart, since as a member of one body you were called to peace and to be thankful. And that's what I'm talking about, peace and to be thankful. Amen. I just want to stop the music there because I want to talk more. Amen. And I want to see who's there. Amen. And I want to just do a one-on-one -on -one with you, my sister and brother. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Amen. I'm just setting this up. And those that are out there, please send a comment or just say hi or, you know. <laughs> Did I know that you're watching? Oh, I see there's about five of you watching already. God bless you. Amen. Again, I come tonight, amen, again in spirit and in truth to share the truth, nothing but the truth. So help me, God. Please send a comment so I know who's there. Okay, I see, oh, I see Carmen Ebanks, uh, Mita, amen, Al Perry, amen. God bless you guys all out in New York and and here in, in, in Florida, amen. I want to give a shout out of love to everybody. But we know that we're coming into Thanksgiving and it's a time that we sit down and break bread and, 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 and slice the turkey and give thanks to the Lord for what he's done. And I want to encourage you tonight. Amen. And also remember that let us devote ourselves to prayer and being watchful and thankful for what God has already done. In other words, continue to have that dialogue with the Father. Amen. And, and in Spanish, I would say, vamos recordarnos siempre darle gracias al Señor y a orar como oramos y sabemos que, el, uh, que, que Dios lo dio paz como dice la palabra en Colossians 3 15 no sé cómo dice en español pero dice deja de paz de Cristo entra en su corazón como tú eres un miembro amen, del cuerpo amen, este es llamado para paz y para que tenga thanksgiving Amen. Dándole la gracia, Señor. Amen. I hope I said that right. Uh, because God has opened up doors with my brothers, my bilingual brothers, and I'm going to try my best to encourage and to build them up. 
Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. Again, but this is the time of Thanksgiving and the season of love. Amen. Because you, you're thanking God. And sometimes, you know, we don't get a, a time because we're so working and doing this and doing that. But remember to always give thanks. And always appreciate those that are around you. Amen. Because, again, I'm always saying here that the things that we do do matter, amen, to those that are next to us, our family, our loved ones, our friends, our co-workers, everything that we do. And how do we give thanks to the Lord the most that he loves is when we share kindness and compassion and love because that's what God is all about. Amen. And I say that sincerely, amen. Uh, because you know what? The enemy is always trying to take away the joy and the peace that we have. And that's the thing that I want to talk about tonight. And especially those that maybe done something to you in the past. or and, You know, when we really think about it, man, it, what, does it really matter? Amen. Our past. What matters of the thing is that once we were lost, but now we're found. And as we do that, God has forgiven us. Let us learn to forgive others and let it be a season of that, that we forgive and also we forget. Amen. Sometimes we hold on to things. But I want to say to you tonight, let us forgive with a great, you know, with the heart of God. Amen. Because that's God's heart. He's forgiven us. Let us forgive those around us. Amen. And encourage one another. And that's the most important thing that I can say to you tonight. But also, I just want to share this, that a uh, few verses, because you know I'm coming at you with the word, nothing but the word of God. Amen. I'm just trying to put some music here in the background to give me a little bit of... <laughs> Oh, yes. So I can read some scriptures. I'm trying something new to get you to watch and to, I'll use any tool that I can. Remember this. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. For his steadfast love endures forever. That's Psalms 107 verse 1. Also, I want to lay on you, my brothers and sisters, I will give thanks to the Lord. The thanks due to his what? righteousness and I will sing praises to the name of the Lord the most high amen that's Psalm 7 verse 17 and always remember this my brothers and my sisters amen that whatever happened always be thankful this is how God wants you to live in Christ Jesus amen again I want to say that that whatever happens always be thankful this is how god wants you to live in christ jesus en español dice que cualquier uh, lo que pase amen siempre te alegre y dándole gracia eso lo que quiere dios que tú viva en jesucristo y eso es first First Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 18. First Thessalonians chapter 5, 13. That whatever happens, always be thankful. This is how God wants us to live in Christ Jesus. So if you're going through something or maybe you heard some negative news, man, remember that we don't know. I'm always saying, or maybe you didn't get that job or maybe you didn't get that promotion. Remember. God always knows what's good for us, but we give him thanks even when things happen. Amen. That's how we're to live our lives in all things. Give him thanks. And that's what I come today to say. Again, I want to give a shout out to all of you. Give a shout out to uh, uh, Full Gospel Tabernacle in Far Rockway, Pastor uh, Carlos Hamilton and Maggie and all my brothers and sisters out there I love you, amen, and you continue to encourage us and we continue to love and to share the love in New York here in Florida and all around the world as we come on social media to say thank you Lord 
Thank you, Father, for what you've done in our lives. And thank you, Father, that we can remind one another and to encourage one another with love and the truth. And let us come together, as God said, as we come together as brothers and sisters, we can change the world. Amen. Because God has anointed you and I to share the love of God. Amen. Which is the gospel. Amen. And I'll use anything and every tool to share that. Amen. So again, that whatever happened, always be thankful. And this is how God wants you to live in Christ Jesus. Remember, don't be anxious about anything, but in everything, pray and supplication with what? Thanksgiving. Again, thanksgiving. Amen. Let your request may make uh, be known to God. Amen. And my request is always, man, I'm here, my sister and my brother, and to love you and to encourage you. And this is what God is saying to us today. Remember that Jesus prayed. Father, I thank you for those, which is you and I, my sister and brother, that you're giving me. Father, let them be one as we are one. And then we will come and be with them. Amen. And I want the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Within me. So we got to talk the truth and speak the truth and love on each other. Amen. So remember. And let the peace of Christ rule where? In your heart to which indeed you were called in one body and be what? Thankful. Amen. That's Colossians chapter 3, verse 15. Oh, Father, I just thank you tonight, Lord. I thank you that I can come here tonight, here at Love Wings Ministry Studio, and you've given me another opportunity to speak about your goodness in this season of Thanksgiving, Lord. Father, let it be a season every day in my sister out there and my brother. Amen. And remember... That whatever goes on, remember in your life, man, just give it to God. God is there for you. He's omnipresent. He's all around. He wants to let you know, as he's speaking through me tonight, that he loves you and he cares about you and he knows what's going on. He just said, put it in my hands. Amen. Why I keep saying that? Because that's what I do. Amen. And that's what's helped me. And I want to be a witness and a testimony. Remember that we still under construction amen he's still working in your life and in my life but we can thank god in advance for those things yet not seen and we can continue to believe and to trust amen for the goodness of god is always in us amen so my sister and brother remember that that again whatever happens always be thankful this is how god wants you to live in Christ Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. And also remember that the Lord is my strength and my shield. In him my heart trusts. Amen. And I will help my heart exalt and with him what my song I give thanks to the Lord. That's Psalm 28 verse 7. Amen. So again, I want to say, man, that God loves you and God is concerned about everything. But you can give thanks today because he loves you and I love you. Amen. And your wife loves you. Your husband loves you. Your children love you. And that's what it's all about. Let us go out and share the love in mi hermanos and mi hermanas allá en West Palm Beach and Nueva York and Desea. Amen. En, en Florida, amen. Vamos a señalar a todo el mundo en nuestro pueblo, en nuestra iglesia, el amor. Y vamos a andar en el Espíritu Santo y hablar la verdad, amen, en nuestra vida, amen, que es la palabra del Señor, amen, que sigue, amen. So cuando te sientes a comerte ese, ese pavo, amen, y están los amigos y las hermanas y los hermanos, recuérdate, Dale gracias a Dios que están en tu vida y dale el, el, el amor que te dio el Señor. Pásalo a tus hermanos y mis hermanas. Amén. Vamos a andar en el Espíritu Santo. 
Amén. No en este flesh, en el espíritu andamos. Amén. En el nombre de Jesús. Aleluya. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. For his steadfast love endures forever. Thank you, Father. Father, I pray tonight for those that are out there right now, Lord. Those that watch this video. Father, Lord, I pray love. I pray peace. Father, I pray that you're stirring their hearts. Lord, right now, Father, Lord, and those that are around them, Lord. Father, let us hold on to one another, my God, Lord. For we don't know the time that you're coming or the time that we leave this body, Lord. But, Father, we're ready and active in love. And in your word. Oh, hallelujah. And that's what it's all about. Be ready. For our destination is in you, Father. Amen. So I thank you tonight. I thank you, Father, Lord, that you love us with a love that never ends. You love us and forgive us of all our sins. And I thank you for Jesus. Amen. Father, I thank you for Jesus that what he went on the cross for me and my sister out there and my brother. And whatever circumstances they're going through, as your word says in 1 Thessalonians 5.18, whatever happens, always be thankful. This is how God wants you to live, my sister and brother in Christ Jesus. So we're thankful tonight. I'm thankful for you. And Father, again, I pray, Father, if anyone in body, Lord, I pray healing in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, if anyone's lonely out there, I pray, Father, Lord, that you're stirring their spirit right now and knowing that you're there with them, Father, that you send your angels all around about them, Lord. Father, let us step out in faith and continue to walk in the things that you call us to do, Father, Lord, to share the truth and to share the love that you've given to us and to forgive one another, my God. Father, we bind and loose any demonic spirit that will try to hinder what has been said tonight here. And through your word, Lord, as we give thanks, oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever. Thank you, Father, that no matter what season, Lord, or what's happening around the world, Lord, Father, Lord, you're there with us, my God. And Father, I pray that right now that I'm encouraging those right now, Father. And Father, we don't know sometimes why things happen, Father, but we learn through your word and through our relationship, Father, from son to father and from daughter to father, Lord, that we trust you and we put it in your hands, Lord. And I pray that tonight, Lord. I pray peace, Lord, as we come into Thanksgiving. So remember, Call someone, let them know, invite them over to the house, amen, uh, and, 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 and break bread together, man. And this is a time of thanksgiving and forgiveness and to have compassion. And we can do this every day because every day in my life is thanking the Lord for this day that he has made, as the word says. And when we start walking in that, man, and we start applying that and speaking it out out of our mouths, Amen. And believing and trusting and always acknowledge him. Amen. And he's there right with you. And the Holy Spirit that's within you will arise and your flesh will descend. Amen. So remember, man, we love you. Amen. And again, God loves you. And remember, again, as I was saying, in... Uh, Psalm 7, 17 says, I give to the Lord the thanks due to his what? Righteousness. I will sing praises to the name of the Lord, the Most High. Amen. Siempre dale gracias, Señor. Aleluya. Como dime Salmo 7, 17. Amen. Yo voy a darle al Señor gracias. Por su misericordia 
y por el amor, amén, lo alabaré con una canción en el nombre del Señor. Aleluya. Oh, Jesus. You are awesome, God. I give a shout out to all of you out there. And I, I pray that this be a time of renewing as I do every year. And, and I renew my mind and my spirit every day to the word of God. And I want to encourage you to do that also. And as we do that in every day, give thanks for those things yet not seen or tangible or those healings. Remember, God still works miracles. He said, just put it in my hand. He says, ask and you shall receive. That's the good news tonight. That's the truth. That's why I come in the spirit and in truth to let you know, my sister and my brother, that God loves you unconditionally and he loves you just where you're at. And if you're confused about anything, man, just get before him and ask him. Amen. He's got an ear for those that seek him after righteousness and truth from the heart. Just simple, man. I'm very simple. You know, and give thanks. Amen. And you'll see that how God will start working in your life. And for those that maybe don't know the Lord, amen, or have heard of the Lord, but never accept them. It's so easy. Never leave a program without sharing this, my brother. It's so easy. Just open up your heart and say, Lord, come in. I feel this void. Help me to understand. Forgive me of my sin. Cleanse me. Amen. And he will. Amen. But you got to be sincere. You got to come from the heart. You see? And once you do that, I thank God for you and that all heaven celebrates, amen, as I celebrate with you. And that's why I'm here tonight. And I'll continue to be here every Tuesday night and every Friday night and Saturdays, amen, and Sunday to share the love and to be a witness and a testimony. And what God has given me, I'm giving you. So what God has given you, go out and give it out. Amen, which is the love of God and the message that continues to give and to give and to deliver and to bind those things, those demonic spirits that are out there. So I give you notice right now. Amen. I come in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, snaggletooth. Amen. And your demonic spirit. Get off my sister and brother. I claim it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen and amen. God bless you. Amen. Again, we're here at Love Wings Ministry Studio. I hope to see you Sunday. We have service at 11 a.m. I'll put the address up. Amen. And again, I just want to thank God for this opportunity and thank you for those that are watching. It really encourages me and my wife and us here, the family here at Love Wings, to continue the work to share the love of God and all mi hermanos y mi hermanas que están allá afuera. Le doy gracias, Señor, por ustedes y estamos aquí a su orden para ayudarlo y, 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 y juntos podemos cambiar este mundo con el amor del Señor. Le doy un shout out a Bobby Guzman, Pastor Bobby Guzman, Jose Hernandez out there and, and, Mar and, and oh, West Palm Beach y todos mis hermanos Allá no lo sé todo nombre, pero le doy eh, eh, bendiciones a ustedes, hermano. Lo quiero mucho y aquí estamos. ¡Órdene! Aquí, mi esposa y yo y la familia aquí de Love Wings Ministry Studio. So again, recuérdase que cuando vamos a sentar en esa mesa, vamos a alabar al Señor siempre. Y, y eso que lo ha sido algo, vamos a perdonarlo. Y vamos a andar en la gloria. This Señor, let us forgive one another and let us walk in the glory of the Lord. Again, remember that, again, I will give the Lord thanks due to his righteousness and I will sing praises to the name of the Lord Most High. Whatever happens, always be thankful. This is how God wants you to live and me in Christ Jesus. That's 1 Thessalonians 
518. And also remember Colossians 3.15 and let the peace of Christ rule in your heart to which indeed you were called into one body and be thankful. Amen, amen, amen. So again, put my stand in mini me. God bless you. I love you. Amen. Have a happy Thanksgiving with your family. Amen. And remember, we're your family here too. We'll lift you up in prayer, all of those that are out there. Amen. All my daughters, amen, that are watchers and supporters here. I love you. Amen. I send my blessings upon my brothers and my sisters. And I'm so grateful of you guys being in my life. I am thankful. And I wanted to come to say that tonight. Whether I haven't seen you or in a while, I'm thankful for you. Oh, maybe out of sight, but never out of my heart and out of my mind. I give a shout out to Iris out in Connecticut. All of you out there. Uh, Donnie, amen, uh, and, uh, and her family, her daughters, everyone. Again, in New York City and here in Port St. Lucie, Fort Pierce, West Palm Beach, uh, Wanna Call Ministry, amen, out there in Fort Lauderdale. Uh, Karen, amen, and the radio station, 89.9 FM, amen. I thank God for you guys. You're a great part of my family and I, we appreciate you. Tom Kernan that moved, amen. I love you, my brother, always, amen. Uh, and in my heart, and told me in manos. And Brianne, I love you out in Indiana. My daughter, you're always in my prayer, and you know, and I'm praying for your mom and your family. And remember, just stand fast. Continue to believe for those things yet not seen, and continue to trust the Lord, amen. So I love you all. And, and 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 Titi out there in uh, uh, Miami, Amen. We're going out there Friday to see you guys. We love you, Amen. Uh, Titi Sessi, Amen. I love you, Amen. I pray healing in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth on all of you. I love you and have a great happy Thanksgiving for my family here. We love you. And we're here for you. Our doors are open. My sister Rosa, Millie, and all of them out there. Paula in New York. Annabelle, David. All of you out there. I love you guys. Amen. All of you have an important meaning in our lives. Joey, uh, Marilyn, uh, everybody out there. Amen. Maria. Amen. And, and for everybody. We love you. And we are always here for you. Amen. And know this. This is the time to forgive, to thank God for what he's already done and what he continues to do in your life. And we're going to continue to pray and intercede for you, my sister and brother. So from Pastor Benny and many me here that we're here tonight, but the Holy Spirit's here and you're there watching us. And I say, pass this video down. I'm grateful for you and Carlos and all of those that we're going to be sitting down and having Thanksgiving together. Amen. Brandon. David's family and his mom, everybody, I love you. And I thank God for you. And I pray blessings and blessings and blessings on you. West Palm, everywhere. Amen. And mi hermanos, God bless you. Amen. Yes! We serve Almighty God. Again, here's our address and our location. Amen. Our location is as follow, 5801 South US 1 Highway 1, amen, Fort Pierce, Florida, 34982. And our number here is 772-834-9634. And remember this, my brothers and sisters, amen. Blessing to all my brothers and sisters. I would love to come and to your church or group and to share my testimony and the word of God, amen, and praise and worship with you, my sister and brothers. Again, you can call 772-834-9634, lovewingsministry at gmail.com. Remember, your brother, Pastor Benny Ramos and Natasha Ramos and the family here, Love Wings, we love you, amen, as Jesus says, amen. Take my hand and 
and let us walk through this day together. Love Wings Ministry Studio, I wish you a happy Thanksgiving Day. And remember Sunday, our service is at 11 a.m. until the Holy Spirit leads us. God bless you. I love you.